In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to clean up a song that has two tracks. One track being the vocals, the other being an acoustic guitar. So let's get started. First thing we're going to do is exterminate any extra noise. This includes a ceiling fan, a fan out of the computer, maybe some outside noise. This works great if you don't necessarily have a true studio that prevents all extra sound. So what you do is you highlight an area of sound that has necessarily nothing in it. But if you turn it up to a high volume, you should be able to hear some crackling or some hissing or some fan noise. And it's always a good idea before you record anything to record empty noise. That way you can cap so you'll have a sound profile to remove it later on. So we're going to highlight a little bit of sound to capture the profile. Not Don't highlight any of the song or that'll ruin the vocals. So you just highlight some dead space that actually has some sound in it. Then you're going to go up to Effects, Restoration, Capture Noise Reduction Profile. Nothing will happen because it's capturing the noise profile that you had highlighted. Now where it really comes in is next. You want to highlight your entire vocal piece, then go to Effects, Restoration, Noise Reduction Process. Now what's going to happen is it's going to use the captured profile that you used and you'll be able to see that. They'll be red, green, or yellow typically. Now the noise reduction is going to use the captured profile that you captured just a little bit ago and apply it to the entire piece. So that hissing necessarily will be gone through the entire piece. This also works great in telephone recordings and other materials. All right, the next thing we're going to do is normalize the song because there's some spots where Casey when singing peaked and it has slight distortion. So we're gonna bring it down a little bit to prevent any clipping. Says I need rest. All I need is that tenderness. Put me on your critical list, cause all I need is her sweet kiss. Dog gave me a medicated lotion, said it couldn't soothe my emotion. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight the entire piece and we're gonna bring it down so it doesn't clip or cause distortion and reach the red boxes. We're gonna bring it down and by normalizing it to negative 0.1 decibels. This will bring it right up to zero, but it won't clip. Kiss. Dog gave me a medicated lotion, said it couldn't soothe my emotion. Now you can see the bar never reached zero. Next, I'm going to remove all of the breaths that Casey took in while singing. The noise capture profile didn't remove these because breathing wasn't part of the profile that you captured. So you need to go through and make sure that you remove all the breaths. <gasps> that Casey took or whatever vocal piece you're working on. It's important that you realize what are breaths and what's not the beginning of words. I'm coming down. Now we're going to do some hiss reduction in case there's any hissing in the piece. I'm going to use a light hiss reduction. Now we're going to apply a slight mastering reverb. Reverb is typically used during processing of vocals to make it sound thicker. So you're going to go under Studio Reverb and you're going to choose Mastering Reverb under the presets. Then hit OK. Doctor says I need rest. All I need is that tenderness. Put me on your critical list cause all I need is her sweet kiss. Dog gave me a medicated lotion, said it couldn't soothe my emotion. Well, I don't need no doctor. I'm coming down with the misery. I don't need no doctor. I'm coming down with the misery. 
All right, now I'm gonna work on the guitar piece. It's gonna be simple. I'm gonna go to Graphic Equalizer, Effects, under Effects Preset, I'm gonna choose Guitar, Increase Attack. You'll really be able to tell the difference. All right, before you mix down the tracks, make sure the signal out is set to master. This way, they'll both get mixed down together. And then go to master output in session stereo. Now you will see your track has been mixed down. The vocals and guitar are on the same piece. So now highlight the whole piece and go to multiband compressor. Once in multiband compressor, look at effects presets and choose classical master. Then hit OK. Now you should be able to hear your piece as it is now finalized. Baby, let